welcome to Optics Trades YouTube channel. I'm Andras here with Johnny from Holosun. We're at EVA 2024, checking out their new products for the year. As usual, their uh, booth is crowded with people. Um, they always have interesting things to show, and this year is, of course, no exception. And what we have here is exceptionally interesting. So you've developed actually the first thermal pistol red dot sight system. Mm -hmm. And we can see it's not only a red dot, it's a whole, it's a combination of two devices. Is that correct? Correct. Can you explain to our customers a little bit how this is going to work? Absolutely. So we came out with our rifle thermal sights last year, or at least we announced them. And then something we decided to work on was it for a pistol. Now, if you put too much weight on top, it, you're going to have issues with the functionality of the firearm. So what we did is we integrated the thermal sensor down here in the same body that you would normally have a light. So that's something that people already normally train with. It doesn't feel any different. You still have the function to use a light on here too. So you're not losing any, any functionality. Um, this unit here has the light and the thermal sensor. This communicates with the, with the optic itself, which can be used on its own. So you can just use it as a normal red dot. It's about the same size as a 507 comp, so it's a pretty big window. And then it is also enclosed. So you can use that as normal. And then when you choose to, you just click two buttons and it turns on the thermal system and you're able to, to see all the heat signatures. That's really interesting. So uh, here you have the buttons for, uh, for the intensity of the illumination. On the other side, you will be able to switch for uh, between thermal yeah, absolutely. things, right? Yeah, you'll yeah. have different modes and such like that, just like the other thermal units. And then you can also use this just as a normal red dot. Since this is early in the prototype phase, it's not going to be released this year probably, I assume? Yes, yes that's a good point. Uh, yeah. This is a very early prototype. We just wanted to show you guys what we're working on, as we always do. Um, and we like to get input and you know learn from how we can better improve the optic before we actually release it. So I don't anticipate this being ready until about mid next year. There is also probably no anticipation yet of how much this is going to cost. Correct. We're hoping for under $1,000, but uh, time will tell. Thank you, Johnny, for uh, sharing the prototype with us. Absolutely. If you found it useful, hit like, subscribe. If you have any additional questions, even though it's still early in the prototype phase, so we don't have much information, but you can still leave a comment and we'll try to answer. And uh, check out our other videos from uh, EVA 2024 and see you in the next video. Take care.